everybody's final thoughts before heading to the hospital. Troy, what do you think? I'm voting for boy. Maya, what do you think? I'm voting for boy. And I think it's a boy too. Okay. Maya, how are you feeling about becoming a big sister? Good. Are you nervous? Nope. Are you excited? Yeah. here at the hospital in labor and delivery we came here for our scheduled induction and she got us all checked in and hooked up to all the monitors and the IV and then she checked to see if I was dilated and when she did that she felt like something wasn't right so she went and got the doctor and he came in with an ultrasound and checked and baby has flipped so the baby is laying side to side and so they gave me two options. One was to go ahead and plan a c-section or two try to get the specialist to be able to flip the baby from the outside um, and I ended up deciding just to go ahead and plan a c-section for tomorrow because they said that it was more risky to try to flip the baby it could distress the baby. There's not very much fluid around the baby. So without enough fluid, it's harder to flip him or her. And then it could cause the baby to be in distress and then we'd have to do an emergency C-section. They also said with how the baby is laying, it makes the C-section a little bit more difficult. So it'd be better if it wasn't an emergency and wasn't rushed. So even though it was not my plan at all, to have a c-section whatever's best for baby and me and whatever is going to be the easiest and healthiest um, that's all that matters is having a healthy delivery and a healthy baby um, I am freaking out because I didn't even think that a c-section was an option like I never have even like gone over that in my head but it is what it is and I'm just gonna roll with it and hope for the best and hope for not terrible recovery. So since I'm already hooked up to the monitors and the IV, my doctor wants me just to stay here tonight and he will be in tomorrow, which is Saturday, or sorry, Sunday, August 5th. And he will be doing the C-section about 11, 11.30 in the morning. So I'll keep you posted. <music> What's it look like? Here. I don't know. Huh? Let me come over here. Know. What's it look like? I don't know. You don't know? You got a baby sister. Sister? Maybe. 
You got baby sister? Can you go tell everybody? You wanna go tell everybody? You wanna stay in here for a little bit? You wanna bit stay in here for a little bit? Hold it. Well, look here. Tell the camera what you have. A baby sister. All right. <laughs> You excited? Huh? You've been waiting all day. What's her name? You know her name? Mason. Mason. So you was all ready for a boy. You know the boy's name, don't you? <laughs> Let's right we'll see here. your shirt. What's that say? Big sister. All right. And there's mom and baby. <laughs> Thank you.